They're basically just giant turtles. Oh, wait, what? The hell just happened there? What is going on guys and welcome to episode 3 of season 4 of Jurassic World Evolution 2. The Sanctuary Park. Last we left off we um, added in a bunch more herbivores and a bunch more carnivores. And we're ready to add in 8 more herbivores and 6 more carnivores. So what we're going to do since we released 2 carnivores here and 2 carnivores here and 1 carnivore here and 1 carnivore here. We're going to reverse it. These will have 2 carnivores and these will have 1 carnivore. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do now. So without further ado, let's get on with the herbivores. Alright, herbivore number one is... Ankylodicus, okay. We've got a hybrid, our first hybrid. Herbivore number two, what is it? Sauropelta, okay, that's, that's a pretty good one. What's number three? Microceratus, okay. Number four? Struthiomimus, it just passed Stegoceratops. Alright, um... Four more. Brachiosaurus, okay. And what's number six gonna be? Taurosaurus, okay, we haven't seen that in a good bit. What's number seven? Diplodocus. And number eight, what's it gonna be? Styracosaurus, okay. So the eight herbivores are Ankylodicus, Sauropelta, Microceratus, Struthiomimus, Brachiosaurus, Taurosaurus, Diplodocus, and Styracosaurus. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna filter this to herbivores. We're gonna bring Ankylodicus over here. All right, there we go. That's every single one of them thrown in. Let's get two more Brachiosaurs because I wanted to get four of those. We'll get those and then you know what? We might get one more Dreadnoughtus to go with these guys. That's what we'll do. One more Dreadnoughtus and then we'll be good to go. We'll only have the two Ankylodicus though. We'll throw one more Dreadnoughtus in. All right, I think that's everyone. Let's start releasing Sauropelta in the meantime. Our first new dinosaur to be released. Added in. Sauropelta. I don't think this guy has ever been in a sanctuary before. So this should be interesting. All right, so that's Sauropelta. Let's get the Ankylotica sound. Our first hybrid. Look at how big these guys are, towering over the Sauropelta. I'm surprised that didn't run it over. I really am. And then get out of the way so then the last Dreadnoughtus can come in. Don't be blocked. Okay, good. You're not blocked. Now we got the third Dreadnoughtus. Ooh, that's a nice looking Dreadnoughtus, actually. Yeah, I figured I'd add in a third Dreadnoughtus. Just so we can have three of them. There we go, that's the first hatchery done. Let's move on to the second. Let's release the Microceratus. I don't think these guys are gonna last very long, if I'm gonna be honest. Neither will the Struthies. All right, moving on to the Struthiomimus. <laughs> Alright, so that's the second one done. Let's release the Taurosaurs next. Alright, so that's the Taurosaurs done. Let's release the Brachiosaurs next. Alright, so that's Brachiosaurus being released. We'll release the other two while we're there. And now for the final ones. Let's start with the Styracosaurus. We'll have to see how 
how long these guys can survive for. Alright, that's Dyrakosaurus, and now let's release Diplodocus. So many sauropods. I cannot wait for this guy to get his Mattel figure. That comes out September 29th, I believe, at Target. And once it hits shelves, I'm gonna grab it. Alright, that's Diplodocus. Let's release the other two. And now all the herbivores have pretty much been released. Let's move on to the carnivores. Alright, we're gonna release six carnivores. Carnivore number one is Monolophosaurus. Okay, alright. The second carnivore will be Suchomimus. Alright, Suchomimus. Carnivore number three, Compsognathus. So, alright, so far pretty small carnivores. Carnivore number four. Ooh, Australovenator. Alright. Alright, we've got two more. What will carnivore number five be? Looks like it's gonna be all small carnivores. Proceratosaurus. Come on, give me a giant one for the last one. Alright, not quite what I had in mind, but I'll take it. Gigantoraptor. Okay, so for the six carnivores, we have Monolophosaurus, Suchomimus, Compsognathus, Australovenator, Proceratosaurus, and Gigantoraptor. So we're gonna go ahead and release those. We'll get those three. Alright, that should be every single one of them. So let's go ahead and release the Monos first. Alright, that's Mono done. Moving on to Suchomimus. Suchomimus hasn't been a thing since season one. Remember Sea Flame? Of course you do. Alright, that's Suchomimus done. Compsognathus. Australovenator. Proceratosaurus. And finally, Gigantoraptor. I like the blue one. That looks nice. All right, that's every single creature released. Let's turn everything on. All right, everything's been enabled, so we should start seeing, you know, carnage and whatever. Now, the two Mementi sores are still kind of just chilling. We've got the Brachiosaurs doing whatever. I think that's the Jurassic Park 3 one. All right, we got a fight between two Troodons, but that's to be expected. They're probably fighting for dominance. We are start off with same species fighting. We've got a lone Dinochirus. Let's. I think that's the same one I saw. We name you Donald Duck. We'll name you Donald Duck. We'll name you Daffy Duck. Up, oh, we've got Cocarodonosaurus going up against Cryolophosaurus. Ooh, thirty-three percent against one hundred percent. Yeah, that that Cryolophosaurus just died. Are you the last one? No, we've still got one more. You're the last of your kind now. What should I name you? Hmm. I should probably make a Cryolophosaurus Godline member. Hmm. I don't know. Werosaurus against Werosaurus. Where was I? Oh yeah, the Dinochirus. Where are the Dinochirus? Um, I named one Donald Duck. I named one Daffy Duck. Mono against Mono. All right, so we got Donald Duck, Daffy Duck. And Daisy Duck. Yeah, that's what we'll have. Two Australovenators duking it out. We've got a Seal of Physis, kind of just on its own. 
you know, minding its own business. Taurosaurus against Taurosaurus, that's not really surprising. We got a Parasaurolophus just chilling. Wait, are you the Lost World Para? You are the Lost World Para. I like the Lost World Para, it looks really nice. We got two Proceratosaurus fighting. Do we still have a Giga? Yeah, we still got a Giga. Charcoal's still alive. You're one of the weaker predators. I gotta say. Your traits are fit, so... Oh, no, you are strong saying that. And you're about to fight something, it looks like. A mono. Really? You're gonna go for something easy? You've got plenty of sauropods. Yeah, I thought that would be a fake out. You've got plenty of sauropods to choose from. You've got Dreadnoughtus and you've got Ankyloticus. Much larger prey to choose from. Parasaurs are kind of just chilling, minding their own business. The Ankylosaurs are chilling, minding their own business. We've got the last remaining Utah Raptor just walking around. You know, I might name you. Red Robin. You can be Red Robin. We got an Australovenator. We got a Proceratosaurus going after a... Oh, they're hunting down a Gigantoraptor. Okay. Oh, God. It's not looking too good for this guy. We got Pyroraptor. We got Pyroraptor going after a Triceratops, it seems, as well. Yeah, the Compies are starting to drop like flies. So what I might as well do is start automating the compies. Yeah, let's automate them. Let's get... Oh, you can get... You can get up to 40 of them? Okay. That's good to know, I guess. Let's get 8 for now. I can't believe you can get up to 40 of them. That's... That's crazy. That's crazy. Well, that Gigantoraptor died to the Proceratosaurus. The Carcharodontosaurus is about to eat it. Charcoal going after a Mono. A Mono just died. We got Compies being released. We got Charcoal hunting down a Dreadnoughtus. This is pretty accurate. Because that's the kind of prey Gigas will go after. A lot of crap bigger than themselves. We got a Sukamimus going after one of the going after Kermit, I believe that is. 100% against 77%. They're calling it off. We got a Proceratosaurus going after a Staracosaurus. Oh, they they fight one on one. That's good to know. You'd think a Proceratosaurus wouldn't be able to do that, but no, apparently it can. Pyroraptor versus Australovenator. Where it looks like you did take some damage. They're doing a little dance. It's not looking good for the Australovenator. 16% against 80%. They're calling off their fight. The Pyroraptors are actually pretty strong. I don't know if they took down the Triceratops or not. Oh, they did. They did take it down. It's just dead on the ground. Well, at least they won't be struggling. Anyway, the Pyroraptors are pretty strong. Meanwhile, we've got Stegosaurs kind of just minding their own business and whatever. I don't, I don't think either of them are Mage. Which one's Mage? There's Mage. Mage is kind of just chilling. Another Proceratosaurus going after a Stiggy. Or Styracosaurus, even. All three Dreadnoughtus are still alive. Charcoal's hunting down a Dreadnoughtus now. He's trying to make the most out of what he's got, it looks like. I think Troodon's got the upper hand here. Yeah, you're looking for food now. You're getting a little hungry. All right, they're calling off their fight. Daffy Duck is going up against a Nasutoceratops? Oof. I didn't know these guys were aggressive towards them. It says, let me see what it says there. No, they're, um, they're indifferent. They're indifferent. 
towards each other. I don't get it. Yeah, now this area is getting a little more full. Got a Krylophosaurus just killed a... What was that? Proceratosaurus? Yeah. Krylophosaurus just killed Proceratosaurus. We got Kermit fighting a Sukumimus, it looks like. We got a Gigantoraptor fighting another Cacarodonosaurus. These are always interesting. Gigantoraptor you'd think wouldn't stand a chance against this guy. He did get some kicks in, though. They're basically just giant turtles, these guys. Oh, wait, what the hell just happened there? Ah. Uh, okay, well, the Gigantoraptor is still alive. Looked like it was about to die, but then it just sprung back up for some reason. All right, we got Troodon versus Coelophysis. Pyroraptor versus Coelophysis. Yeah, that Coelophysis is dead. There was no saving it. Sukumimus hunting down a Struthiomimus. Ooh, that's kind of a brutal animation. Damn. Right, you're probably gonna go eat that now, I would imagine. No. We got Red Robin killing a Monolophosaurus. Good for you. What's your strat like? Your status? Two wins, no losses. All right, you're surviving. You're a survivor. I think that's a Troodon. Ooh, going after a Coelophysis, it looks like. Yep. I kind of feel bad for the Coelophysis. We got Kermit going after something. A Sukumimus. All right. They're in his territory. That's why he's going after them. What's your pattern? Celador, Huasco, Pelophylax. Good to know. Alright, they're calling off their fight. We got an Australovenator going after a Compi, it looks like. Nasutoceratops versus Cryolophosaurus. The last living Cryolophosaurus. Charcoal killing another Monolophosaurus. We got Pinocchio hunting down a Dreadnought. Is he still alive? I wonder if he went up against uh, Charcoal who would win. Probably Charcoal, right? The fact that the medium-sized carnivores go after sauropods. It's kind of mind-blowing. We got a Troodon going up against a Styracosaurus. It just got killed by a Styracosaurus. Alright, how many Troodons do we have left? Let me take a look. Troodon, only three, alright? Alright, well, that's Segisaurus. How many Coelophysis do we have? Only one! We only have one Coelophysis left. Where's the last living Coelophysis? Let me, let me take a look. Um, there you are, buddy. The last living Coelophysis. How you doing, buddy? You could be Graphite, I guess. I'll name you Graphite. We got an Australovenator hunting down another Compi, it looks like. Troodon looks like it's going after something else. An Archeornithomimus, that is? No, Struthi, all right. Red Robin going up against a Proceratosaurus just killed one. How many of those do we have left? We got a Pyroraptor going after an Australovenator. 26% against 89. Yeah, that Pyroraptor's dead. How many, um, what's it? Uh, Proceratosaurs. We've got five. We've still got five of them left. All right. Cool, I guess. Sukumimus hunting down a Sintalsaurus, it looks like. All right. We'll have to see how this goes. Got him. Yep, definitely got him. We gotta eat him. Cool. Nice. We got a fight between Kermit and a Sukumimus. 75% against 100%. Oh, the Sukumimus, I think, got the first hit in. Not looking good for Kermit, actually. He got two hits in, the Sukumimus, even. 
wonder if something will finish off Kermit. The Sukumimus one. You're resilient, strong, and defensive. Okay. Cool. Meanwhile, we've got a Gigantoraptor kind of just running around looking for food. Uh, the Gigantoraptor's kind of just eaten in front of the... Or should I say on top of the Carcharodontosaurus. Just eating some vegetation. And then we've got Gigantoraptor hunting enough... Or sorry, not, not Gigantoraptor. Australovenator hunting down a Compsignathus. Py another Pyroraptor going up against an Australovenator. They're doing a little dance. 85% against 3%. Not looking too good. There's a Proceratosaurus killed by Red Robin. All right. Red Robin, you're kind of surviving. The last living Utah Raptor. Kermit, meanwhile, is hunting down a Struthiolimus, it looks like. We got Stegosaurus versus Ankylosaurus. Ooh. I think the Ankylosaurus is about to die. 68% against 100%. Ooh, they both get hits in. What are these things? Moros. Yeah, they're 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 very hungry at this point. Alright. Now what's and? Oh, Ankyloticus, I think. The Giga, I think, is going after an Ankyloticus, it looks like. Alright. Where are these Moros? Alright, give me a second while I give them food, I guess. Troodon going up against Graphite. The last living Coelophysis has died. Meanwhile, we've got Pinocchio attacking a Monolophosaurus. How many of those do we have left? Kermit versus a Gigantoraptor. Oh. The hell just happened. What? It says that it's alive, but it's clearly not. What is going on with these Gigantoraptors? Oh, what? It just sprung back to life! Yeah, you just sprung back to life. Like, what the hell just happened? Don't know what the hell- We got a fatal injury from- Oh. Pinocchio. You absolute monster. You just killed a sauropod. What do you have to say for yourself? Lunchtime, that's all I have to say. <laughs> oh my god, and now you're inside of it. Oh, we got a poison creature, we got a Struthiomimus that was just poisoned by a Troodon, it looks like. How many Monolophosaurs do we have left? Let's take a look. How many Monos? Mono, Mono. Only one! Okay. Wuerosaurus versus Cryolophosaurus. Alright. How many of these guys do we have left? One, two, three, four. We still got four. I don't know. Pinocchio is kind of unstoppable. Australovenator going up against another Pyroraptor. The Pyroraptor took a hit. That's a purple Pyroraptor. 64% against 99%, and you're getting a little hungry. Well, it's not looking good for the Pyroraptor. The Pyroraptor just died. Now you get your free meal. We've got another Australovenator killing a Proceratosaurus. I think, I think there's only a few of them left. We've got one, two, three. Only three left, all right. Australovenator hunting down a Compsignathus, it looks like. I, let's see, another Australovenator going up against a Compi, it looks like. All right. I think this is a good place to wrap up the episode, unless something eventful happens. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.